This tutorial is meant to teach you how to send your document through email straight and how to modify your documentation properties. The first thing we will look at is sent email. One of the best qualities with Selfram Office Write is that you are now able to send the documentation that you have done through email straight instead of attaching it in your email. All you have to do is click on send and there are various options in which you can send your documentation through either through email straight or email as self frame document text which means that your document will be in the self frame document text format or email as Microsoft Word straight or email as PDF so you can choose whichever option you want and click on it for example I choose email as Microsoft Word I click on it once you click on the email as Microsoft Word automatically your default email browser will pop up and you will have the attachment in your email browser and all you have to do is type the subject type the recipient and click on send and your documentation will be sent to the recipient in a Microsoft Word format and the next thing we'll look at is create master document all you have to do is click on it and you can choose the, the, the path where you want to put it as a master document once you've clicked on it, just say desktop, choose a file name, and then save as type software document master document. And all you have to do is click on save, and your document will be saved as a master document. The next thing we'll look at is the properties. Once you click on the properties, you can see that there are a few tabs. In properties, it gives you or it defines your document's property. For instance, this shows the title of your document, the type of your document, the size, when was it created, by who, the editing time, it gives you whether you want to apply user data, you can delete it if you want to, you can put digital signatures for your documentation. Next, if you see description, you can key in the description of your documentation, for instance, I put in You can put in keywords I can put in comments if I want to then I can go next to user define you can put info whichever info you want to define in your documentation you can choose internet if you're putting in HTML document you can choose whether you want to refresh automatically or do not want to refresh automatically if you want to refresh the document automatically you can set every how many seconds you want to document to be refreshed or you can allow to redirect from this document after how many seconds to which URL or to which frame. Statistics will show you what is the number of pages that you have in your document currently, if there are any tables, how many tables there are, if there are graphics or there are any OLE objects, the number of paragraphs you have. The number of words, characters, number of lines, you can even update it. So once you've done changes, you just click OK and the changes will be saved. So basically in this tutorial, you learned how to send your documents straight through email without having to go to your email browser and attach a document. This can be done straight away and you can choose the format in which you want to email a document and the properties and, and how you can read or you, how you can understand properties in which you are able to know the type of this document you can edit you can put keywords and how you can make it into a html format how you want to refresh it and also you can read the statistics of this document